Hello again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 28th of January, 2019. One of my friends out of Florida sent me a rather interesting video. It was put up by Richie from Boston. It's 12 minutes and 22 seconds in duration. When I got it, it had 77,758 views. Title, Trump will usher in the seven Noahide laws. One world religion. And what's written is the Sanhedrin has already praised Donald Trump and will use him to usher in the seven Noahide laws which flies directly in the face of God's Ten Commandments. Wake up people, nobody stopped the New World Order. They are just in their final phases between Jesuit Pope Francis and Jesuit Trump Pence. They are working to the same goal, the dismantling of Christianity in America. The video is uh, somewhat revealing. It shows the Sanhedrin with a number of previous presidents in the Oval Office. Now, what I have difficulty accepting is that Donald Trump wouldn't be the right guy to choose, nor would most of these other presidents. And the reason that is, is that they don't themselves adhere to the seven laws of Noah. Prohibitions against worshipping idols. Two, cursing God. Three, murder. Four, adultery and sexual immorality. Well, Donald wouldn't be the right guy to choose there, would he? Huh? Theft or eating flesh torn from a living animal. That's a little bit far out of the world, is it not? As well as the obligation to establish courts of justice. So again, I think that the Sanhedrin really wouldn't be trying to use Donald Trump since he sort of goes against at least one of those seven commandments, the one about adultery and sexual immorality. And I think most of your presidents fell into that same category. <laughs> Watch the clip. It's uh, somewhat interesting. Now keep in mind that the Sanhedrin are way out there. Just like the Mormons are like way out there. Every group of religious organizations have folks that are way out there, don't they? Once again, I don't agree with Richie from Boston's take, but it is an interesting video. It's also interesting how YouTube went at him and uh, had him change a lot of what he originally posted, I assume, for copyright violation. <laughs> but he has 318,000 views, viewers. I probably would have had the same, if not more, if they wouldn't have done what they did to me. And you have to sort of wonder, how come folks that post what he posts aren't removed? Hmm? Just thought I'd ask the question. <laughs>